Okay, next uh, we're going to do the truss pole installation on the telescope. All right, and uh, one thing to note here is that seven of the eight truss poles are uh, exactly the same, top and bottom, um, so no difference whatsoever. Uh, the one truss pole here that's obviously different is this one with a cable wrapped around it. Uh, this is the one that's going to bring the 12 volt power uh, from the Kendrick box down on the bottom. Uh, to the secondary dew heater that you have up top um, for the uh, for the secondary mirror. The thing to note with that is that both ends of the cable are different. Uh, one is male and one is female. Uh, so you don't want to get them confused. Uh, the male end always has to be uh, oriented down toward the bottom. So when you're plugging this particular truss pole in, this always has to be going down. All right, so you don't want to end up with the male at the top because uh, then you'd have to take it apart, um, or the truss, you know, the eight poles apart and flip it. Uh, so just always remember that. All right, so now what I do is I take two truss poles at once and plug them both in at the same time, because that's the easiest way to do it, I've found. Uh, all right, so we have this one with the cable, which always has to plug into this particular truss block here. All right, so this one always has to plug in here because it will plug into the Kendrick box on the bottom here. So it's easiest if you end up plugging it in here and not over here because the cable won't reach. All right, so you just have to remember that. So the easiest way to do the poles, like I said, is take two at a time and do them on the same side of the box. You think of a box has four sides, you do two truss poles on the same side at the same time versus doing both in the same block because then you're trying to figure out okay what angle do the poles go at to meet with the opposing pole it's easiest like I said if you do it this way because right. in that case you could take one hand and keep it up here to keep them aligned in a triangular formation here with the truss and you can use your other hand here to tighten up the um, the knobs here on the truss poles Right, so you want to get them nice and tight, as tight as you can get them, uh, because that's going to keep your collimation nice and sturdy and firm and not allow it to drift. You don't want these truss poles to be loose. All right, so now same thing again. All right, two on the same side, hand on top. Use the other hand to tighten them up right there. Okay, and again, now third side. We'll do this, one pull up here, one pull there, and hand on top. And uh, like I said previously, uh, with these poles, minus the one with the cable on it, they're exactly the same top or bottom, so it doesn't matter uh, which orientation you put them in. Uh, now some people, uh, they go as far as numbering each pole, you know, one through eight, and then numbering the sockets here on the bottom, one through eight, so the same pole goes into the same socket every time. Um, I find, honestly, that's a little excessive. Uh, you really don't need to go to that level um, of complexity with this. Uh, the poles are close enough in length that uh, it really doesn't make any difference in terms of collimation, uh, how well it holds from disassembly to reassembly, uh, where you would need to go to that, that level. But if you want to, by all means, go right ahead. Uh, okay, so we have this set up. We have the poles here. Next is to take your upper tube assembly. Now with this telescope, the eyepiece, the focuser, is on the left-hand side of the telescope. So if we're standing at the rear of the telescope here, and we're standing and looking at the side that has the two fans and the nameplate, the eyepiece will go on the left-hand side here. All right, typically we do a lot of telescopes with the eyepiece on this side. All right, but this particular one, the eyepiece is going to be on the left as we're viewing the telescope from this side. So we take the upper tube assembly and we're just going to take 